to the grand reopening of the Wild Things Vintage Collective. Now, I'm going to be using their footage here to give a little context. Basically, a month ago, there was a really bad flood, and all 40 of their vendors in this huge space had to evacuate. Fortunately, they say that the community really showed up, and a month later, they reopened. Now, the first thing I did when I got there was go straight to their coffee house, The Clapping Monkey, to get myself a latte. And when I tell y'all this place is massive, I mean it. There are goodies hidden in every single corner. This beautiful Nintendo wall. I also loved this vintage Barbie stuff, how on brand. And then grandma told me this was the first cookbook she ever got and it was published in 1957. And then because we're us, I of course had to try on some beautiful vintage clothes, but I do think that the winner of the day were these 1970s pants that pretty much fit like a glove and also these gorgeous shoes. I left with a handful of stuff, including this 1960s dead stock contact paper that I will be using on everything. Grandma left with this cute little Santa and I am just the happiest person ever. If you were local to the Minneapolis area, I urge you to check them out.